This looks like pee. It's not. Um, tip number one, wear a bandana when you're having a bad hair day. Cause it looks like you tried even harder than like doing your hair. Little do you know, if I took this off, you'd take back your compliment. Hello guys, welcome back to my channel or welcome to my channel. I'm Kristen. Subscribe, I don't know, whatever you wanna do. Just, you know, no pressure. <sighs> so today's video I'm actually so excited for. I have wanted to do kind of fashion based videos since day one, like literally since the start of my YouTube career, but I never knew how to do it. I didn't want to do like lookbooks necessarily. And I didn't want to make it like kind of that type of fashion content, which by the way, there's nothing wrong with it. It's just not like me, but that type of content that's very like perfect. I kind of gave up. I kind of gave up the the want to break into the fashion side of YouTube. But again, that was what almost five years ago now. And I'm glad to say that I kind of don't give a fuck anymore. Now I'm just gonna try whatever I want to try because I finally feel comfortable enough five years later to absolutely be myself on camera, which you guys for sure have seen within the past like year or so. I was catching up with my friend Jasmine. She's a stylist. Here's her Instagram, check her out. She is so talented and has styled so many amazing people and amazing outfits. And she's genuinely one of the most down to earth people <laughs> on the planet. She, she styled me, I think it was 2018 VMAs. Uh, I'll find the picture, I'll put it here. That was definitely like, well, that was not only one of my first red carpets, RIP red carpets, um, but that was my first time getting professionally styled. I, I've only been professionally styled maybe twice and that was one of them. Cause I also have my own love for styling and my own love for fashion. And I've been like that since day one. My mom always tells me, my whole family always tells me like when I was a kid, I was called the fashion police. I would walk up to people, not strangers, but like family and be like, your outfit doesn't match. Why are you wearing that? It's kind of a little bitch. But yeah, I had always just had a like love for fashion and eye for it and it's always 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 in my highs and my lows been a way to express myself if i could give you any fashion tip if you're somebody kind of looking to find your style or just play with new styles it's exactly that just just do it play with it who cares if it looks a little stupid the only way i find new and like not, i don't want to say innovative because it's not a fucking technology but like new creative combinations or styles or whatever it is is by just trying and not caring i've definitely had flops of looks but like who cares you know i hope that makes sense i wanted to be styled for a week because something i appreciate when getting styled is being forced to wear things that sound a little intense whatever for lack of a better word being forced to wear things that i wouldn't usually pick out and you'll see a lot of these throughout this video jasmine did a great job i love that she's not afraid of color i like I love color. I wanna do a week of outfits that I didn't choose so that I can try new styles, new colors, new textures. And it was just nice to kind of dress up during a pandemic, because when do we ever dress up anymore? All right, roll day one. Okay, it's Monday. I just finished my makeup and I'm about to have Alex lay out the first outfit. I This is fully a surprise. Jasmine picked out everything. I have no idea what it is, but I'm very excited to get ready. Cause I need to get the fuck out of this. What the hell am I wearing? <laughs> I'm acting like a, it's like a gender reveal. Oh yeah, this is cute! This is very, oh, I guess I should show you. This is very like Emma Chamberlain. Yes. yes. Little tiny little sports bra from Bria Via. Bria Via. H&M, I love this. Very cute. These are gonna look so good on you. Cozy as fuck and I feel like they're gonna give me a donk for yep. show. All right, we love a grout fit, but it's like a blue tone grout fit. Mm -hmm. Grout fit. This is good for like, Ew. well, it was raining a little bit ago, but like a gloomy so day. So read your note. Sorry, I ripped it out. Oh my God, she ripped the note now. <laughs> it reads, hi beautiful. I am so excited to be styling you for the week. I picked out some fun outfits, some dressier than others. Some are comfy and cozy. Can't wait to see you bring them to life. Here's an itemized list of what I've selected. Look one, a gray monochrome look with a blue bralette. This is such a cozy, lazy outfit, but still cute. And then she said where everything's from. The pants are from Waif. That was the one I didn't say. Okay, let me try it on. The gray pants are so comfortable. And I feel like you can dress these up a lot. Like even with a blazer and like 
heels. Like I feel like they could be very businessy. I paired it with a white beanie and just white shoes and my white bag to bring in kind of a little bit of an edge to it. I scored this outfit a solid seven out of 10. You killed it, Jasmine. Blue and gray are actually the two colors that are not in my wardrobe at all. So I love that she is like forcing me to wear them because now that they're on, I love it. Even though I wouldn't have picked this up off the shelf, I love it on and I'll definitely wear this again. Tried to cut my own bangs. Oh good. I'm getting my hair done Friday, so Alexi will get to look forward to that. But hello, it is day two, it is Tuesday. Um, it looks like I just woke up, but I didn't. I've looked like this all day. Very chill inside day as every fucking day has been for the past million days. But I only left the house to go get Chipotle, so I've kind of just been in this. I'm in a little sports bra and some flame pants. But tonight we are going into the studio because we have to record Thursday's episode. Hi, mama. We have to record Thursday's episode, so I'm about to start doing my makeup right now. I'm gonna get ready and then see what Jasmine has in store. Are you sniffing flowers? Are you serious? I love you, little boo-boo. Okay, the makeup is done. I show you as if it's anything different from what I normally do. And then I'm gonna keep my hair in a low bun because it's kind of dirty right now. So I hope this outfit goes with a low bun. Okay, mom, will you come lay out my outfit? One, two, three. Oh, shit! This gives me Liza vibes. Oh, big time. Oh, big yeah. Liza vibes, let me turn on the light. Got some pleather pants. What is this texture? Oh, it's just like, it's like soft. polyester. Look to black faux, le faux leather pants, a black and red graphic tee. I could see this styled with docks or maybe a booty. It rhymes! Did she do, did she do that? Even a cool sneaker moment for a casual look. Top by Vapor95, pants by Waif. So it's that same brand that had those like comfy pants Ooh. yesterday. Oh shit, I love this. Okay, I'm gonna throw it on. I think the bun does totally fit with this. Let me show you guys what I did to zhuzh it up. Okay, so overall, it's very well put together. I really like it. It's just, it's not my style necessarily. I feel like the pants are a little chic for me. As you saw when the pants were laid on the bed, they come with a tie, but I tied the tie in the back to kind of bring a little bit more edge and like masculinity to the outfit. The tie kind of made it a little businessy for the way I took it. You could very easily put it right back in the front with like a little cami and even heels. And I feel like this is damn near like a Vegas going out outfit. As you can see, I chose a white sneaker that looks just like a casual little flat Reebok, but then I also have these little red sneakers. I think these look really good with it too. Overall, I think I would score this outfit a six out of 10. Good morning, guys. It's a few days later. I can't even lie to you. I, this isn't gonna be five days in a row only because my week greatly changed after the last time I saw you because Alex got an eye infection <laughs> and um, she's totally good now. But if you watch the podcast, you probably saw, but um, I had to take care of her. But Next day, outfit is laid out. This is cute. I am just now seeing this outfit. I did my hair and everything way before I even thought about filming today. And it goes with this outfit so well. Let me show you. Such like a 90s little moment. I feel like this is very like, you know, the, the style, like model, off-duty off model. That's what it's called. Like, I feel like this kind of achieves that. She says, light wash denim with a ribbed colorful striped top. This is very much Hailey Bieber energy and I love it off model duty is kind of what I said. Uh, denim is Ferrucci and the top is H&M. So let me put it on and I'll show you. This might be my favorite outfit. I just put it on, I was like, oh cute. Like blue jeans, striped top, like classic. No, oh my God, what is that? Is that a train? Jesus Christ, look at the butt. Are you kidding? Are you kidding? You guys. <laughs> All right, cue the B-roll. I feel like I need to start with the rating on this one. This is a solid 10 out of 10. Would recommend. Jasmine, you killed this. This is very much the silhouette I go with all the time. Cropped with some high-waisted. I think we can all relate. I paired it with just this light pink purse that actually ended up being the exact pink to the light pink in the long sleeve. This is so comfy. These jeans fit me perfectly. That For size reference, these are a 27, I believe. I'm pretty sure they were 27. Oh, I love it so much. Good morning, guys. It is the next day. My face is all red right now because I just did a mask. I'm about to start my period, so hormonal acne, it's, it's here. Whatever, I don't care. I'm excited for today's look because I already kind of like snuck and read the little thing that I'm about to read you. And it's like a sweater dress kind of vibe. I haven't seen it yet. It's kind of cold, so I feel like a sweater dress is perfect. Let me read it to you. Oh, I just, <laughs> I 
just on my toe. I just on my toe. Look. Fuck you. All right, we're back. Look number four. Light color striped dress with detail at bust. I love how casual and cute this dress is. I think it'd look really great with an oversized denim jacket thrown over. And the dress is waif. Here it is. It's, I love how like neutral it is, but then it has a pop of fun of like neon in this type of detailing i've actually never seen curious to see how it looks like on my boobies because my boobies are kind of small and i don't know if it's going to do it justice but we'll see if you know me you know i do not wear dresses so this is already very out of my comfort zone but that's exactly what i wanted this video to be it was things that i would never necessarily pick but they've all been a success let me style it i'll be right back okay so i paired this one with a lot of black just because i knew i wanted kind of a heavier jacket it is a little bit cold outside added the black docks with it i feel like i needed some height or just something to kind of ground me i don't know why i didn't want to do like a dainty heel also the little like breast detailing it i see what was supposed to happen but it just doesn't work on my body also i probably would have sized down just overall in this dress i do feel like there's a little extra fabric and then i paired it with my little green bag this i just wanted this bag to bring out more of the green and yellow because I feel like green tones complement my skin a lot so I kind of wanted to ride with that I'd say like a six out of ten but ten out of ten for comfort this dress is so so comfortable hello it is the next day and it is the last day of being styled for a week straight I am very excited for this last outfit because I'm not gonna lie I just saw a little sneak peek of what looked like pants so let me show you. Oh, I can put you in my closet. Oh, it's kind of dark. Look number five, blue striped pants. Yep, that's what I saw. With a white button down tank. Such resort energy. Can't travel much, but I can see this by the pool, summer tropical. And then it says everything's from H&M. This is perfect because today is actually one of the first warmer days of the the week okay so here's the look like i said i love these pants this cut with like the high waist and the pockets this is my shit i love a good palazzo pant palazzo pant palazzo pants this not so much this isn't really something i'd wear i might mess around with it and maybe unbutton it more and have it be more of a crop but i can tell like as far as the way it's supposed to fit i don't know if i'm gonna love where it sits with like the rise of the pants, if that makes sense. Well, this is kind of a funny way to end the video, but they don't fit. I'm so sad because these pants are so cute. It's too fat. One more. Oh, it's cause it's H&M and an H&M two is it. And I'm usually a two, but H&M twos and never fit. H&M for pants, I usually uh, like bathing suit bottoms. I get like an eight. Okay, I usually size up a lot of H&M because I feel like their sizes are generally really small. Such cute pants though. Very bummed. What she did, a, a like a blank white tank, totally a good go-to. I was also thinking like I would go funky with it. I feel like whenever you give me stripes, I'm going to take full advantage. Like I would hit it with this, bring in the blue, like, oh my God, I'm so bummed these don't fit. Look at this. Look at that even something like this would be so cute this is like it's not usually a bow it like laces around your waist honestly even this i would go so funky with it oh my god this oh that's a more fucking vibe Ooh! if you have the pants try it whoa i'm wearing blue and white stripes it's kind of like the pants in the last clip also i was just editing like before filming this i wasn't in underwear i was wearing shorts underneath so that i could show you guys the fit so like youtube if you're listening i promise those weren't my undies but i guess my ass was kind of out whatever some bikinis show more booty than it anyway i hope you guys enjoyed today's video let me know what you think down below let me know what your favorite outfit was let me know how you would style any of those pieces and ways that i didn't say give me feedback let's let's talk but hey no negativity to any of the looks down below just no negativity guys a fashion is not there is not a one-way street there's i think fashion is infinite that's a damn fact fashion is infinite just wear what you feel good in that's literally all that matters have fun with it express yourself that's what i do and that's how i found my style i hope this video inspires you guys to try something new and if not i hope you just enjoyed the past 
10, 15 minutes. I don't know how long the video is now. Before I go though, I did want to announce, this video is not sponsored or anything, but I did just wanna share with you guys that starting Monday, February 22nd, every Monday going forward at 6 p.m. Pacific Standard Time, I will be going live on Triller. I'll be going live for about a half hour every Monday, and I'm gonna be doing a lot of cooking, a lot of just talking to you guys. So I will link that down below. Go follow me on Triller, and I'll see you every Monday. And one last thank you to Jasmine. I will link her Instagram and her personal YouTube channel down below. Go check her out. She is like an angel on earth. I love her so much. Thank you, Jasmine. All right, I'll see you guys next time. Peace.